Corona. It came with no warning. It came with no invitation. It came without knocking at the door. What a life changer. What a surprise. Sitting in my living room, no power to put it out, no power to call the police. Prayer will not help either. I'm here on my own trying to deal with that stranger. It is not an angel. It is not coming to do any good, but that stranger is here to destroy humanity. It came with a dark light. Only my reaction will convince it. No other choice but to think about to find a solution. First of all, I would like to share my sympathy to all who are victims because of that stranger. It made a lot of people cry. I would like to say sorry to everyone who lost their jobs as well. We witnessed many businesses close their doors. Many people became depressed and less impressed about being in quarantine due to fear. No more hugs, handshakes, kisses, no visitors, no more traveling. Social distancing is the new norm everywhere on the globe. Now, we all have to learn to deal with a new way of living. We have to wear a mask almost everywhere. For those who can take good advantage of that situation, I would say let them. What a change. Life will never be the same. I have to learn fast to cope and accept the current situation. What a fear stranger in my living room. I have to try to comply. Making a U-turn will definitely slow me down. It is clear because of the current situation, some people spend more time with their families. Additionally, many people had no other choice but to work from home. With that luxury comes a lot of downfall with dealing with the kids making a lot of noise in the house. Arrangement, rearrangement, thinking, management on all levels. It is true that every bad comes with some good, but we just have to look closely to find it. Being emotional will not help. Being upset will not help. It is what it is. I have to deal with it. A stranger in my living room trying to take control. It is not an angel. It is coming in a dark mood. I have learned a few things. My life had completely changed. During this personal process, I took the time to learn how to deal with that issue, including taking care of my personal hygiene, taking the time to look into myself, trying to find the small missing part of my life and enjoy all the stuff I was missing before. It is a good time to be in contact with nature in order to find the beauty of it. I took the time to forgive myself, time to learn a new hobby, as well as taking the time to say hi to all that I did not talk to on my contacts. I don't want to give up. I don't want to lose interest in living. I want to know how to appreciate a stranger coming into my living room, trying to determine the quality of life. I refuse to let go. I refuse to get discouraged. I refuse to bow down. Let me stay busy searching, busy reading now to find how the stranger came before with different names. Due to the restrictions, I am limited. I have to get used to be told what to do or not to do. Welcome to the team. Do not blame others. Keep thinking. Humility. In understanding, let focus on helping each other. Focus on living ourselves. I have to deal with it. Its name is Corona. COVID-19. Confinement. Its name is overwhelm. Its name is rude. Rampant. Ridiculous. They call it nasty, not natural. Its name is the attacker, aggressive, arrogant. I think 
that I am not alone in that fight. We have to do what we have to do to survive. We are here to observe, to learn, to grow, and we have to find a way to learn to love. Please tell me if you have the same feeling about that stranger. Thank you.